All right, our next word is the word ride. Okay, so in the word ride, we have an R. And R makes the R sound. Can you make the R sound? Okay, our next letter is I. And it's going to say its name, so it's a long I. Make the I sound. Our next letter is the letter D. The letter D makes the sound D. Okay, and then at the end, we have one of those sneaky, silent ninja E's. So the E is not going to make any sound. Okay. So get your choppers ready. We're going to chop the sounds and then we're going to blend them. R I D ride. Let's do it again. R I D ride. Good. So to ride something usually means that you're sitting on it. Um, we might ride a bike or um, a skateboard. Usually it's something that you get into or sit on and it takes you somewhere. So let's move over to our sentence. And as usual, I'm going to read the sentence first and then I want you to read it with me the second time, okay? I ride the bus to school. Some of you ride buses to school, and some of you are parent pickup or walkers. But if you ride the bus, even if you don't ride the bus to school, you usually ride the bus when we're going to art or music or gym. So we walk onto the bus, we find a seat, we sit down, and then the bus takes us from our school to the middle school so we can go to gym or art or music. And then we get back on the bus find a seat and sit down, and it takes us back to our school. So we're riding, we're getting on it, we're sitting on it, and it's taking us from one place to another. Okay, so now I want you to read the sentence with me. I ride the bus to school. Good. All right, so now I have some pictures. And I want you to tell me if these are things that we would ride or probably not ride, okay? So if they would if we would ride them, they'll go in this column, and if we would not ride them, they'll go in this column, okay? So the first picture Oh, let me bring it over here. The first picture we have is a bike. Would you ride a bike? Yes. You can sit on the seat of the bike and pump the pedals and steer with the steering wheel or the, the handles that act as the steering wheel. And you can ride a bike to get somewhere new or just for fun. So we're going to put the bike over here. Yes, I can ride a bike. All right, next question. Can you ride a dog? It's pretty silly, huh? Some dogs are actually pretty big and they look big enough to ride, but dogs really aren't made for um, to carry the weight of a human. And this dog especially, he looks like a little dog, so I don't think any humans would fit on him and it might hurt him to ride him. So we're going to say no. Usually you would not ride a dog. We're going to put it over here where the X is. That means no. All right, our next picture... We have a train. Can you ride a train? Miss Simons got to ride on a steam engine train like this one when I went to Dollywood. And Dollywood is a theme park. Um, so I got to ride on a train and it took us up a mountain and back down again. So yes, you can get on a train, sit down, and be taken from one place to another on a train. So we're going to put our train over here. Our next picture is a bear. 
Are you going to ride a bear? Well, a bear might be strong enough to ride you, but, or for you to ride it, <laughs> but bears, not always that friendly in the wild. Um, they're wild animals. They uh, want to protect their cubs and look at those big old claws. I would not want to make that thing mad. So bears just really aren't a good idea. If you ever spot a bear, I would not try to ride it. I would try to stay as far away as possible. So we're going to put the bear over here. We're not going to ride the bear. All right, and our last picture, we have a very beautiful horse. Would you ride a horse? Well, people do typically ride horses. Um, a long time ago, before they had cars, people would ride horses or um, tie the horses up to a, a carriage to help them get around. Um, now, people usually just ride horses for fun, for enjoyment, um, but the horses have to be trained a special way before they can be ridden. So that's always something, if you're near a horse, you have to make sure you have an adult with you that um, kind of knows what to do to stay safe around horses, but you can ride horses. So we're going to put it over here. So here we have the things we can ride and the things we should not try to ride. <laughs> okay, let's come back over here. We're going to practice our word. We'll just do it one more time because you guys, I'm sure you've got this by now. Okay, so let's do purple. I want, to get, I want you to get your clappers ready. We're going to make the sounds. I'm not going to do it. I'm going to let you do it on your own. You're going to chop the sounds and then blend it, okay? All right, great job today, guys.